Hi, I'm Marna. This is the Dolls Rescue Channel, and I have a Happy Meal. <clears throat> this one is from Sarah from Octopudding Channel. If you don't know her channel, I'm sure most of you do. Sarah's not just a master crocheter. She actually um, is published in the Crochet Magazine. Um, she does tutorials that are right on point. I mean, stitch by stitch by stitch. If you are new to crocheting, and you have a knack of how to do things, but patterns, you know, aren't your thing, try Sarah's channel. But that is not all she does. Sarah has a lot of dolls. She sews, she does box openings, she shows her collection. Uh, she does all sorts of fun things. And Sarah has that uh, decorating knack. So when you're looking at her, behind her is always um, it's just beautiful, her setups. But I have a box from her. We will leave her link in our um, description below. Let me open this and see what I did get. I was really excited to get this. Um, very surprised. I cannot thank anyone enough for Happy Meal. It's a hug in a box. It really is, and I always say, you know, it's not just the gift, it's the thoughtfulness that the person, you know, they they went and picked it out, or they um, made it, and then they boxed it up, and they, it, it's, it's phenomenal, I, wonderful, oh, oh, look at this, oh, wow, this is Merry Christmas, this is a great big hug, Marna and Darren. I always appreciate it when you include Darren. He's a big part of my channel. I wouldn't have a channel without Darren. I am technically, well, let's call it technically retarded. I, uh, I, I'm not big on tech. Okay, oh, this is really cute. Merry Christmas, or I'm sorry, Christmas magic. To Marta and Darren, hope this arrives before Christmas. Merry Christmas, lots of love. Sarah from Octopudding. And again, we'll put her link in the description. Oh, let's open. Would you like to open one? No, go ahead, babe, but thank you. Nice paper, very nice paper. Normally I try to use it again, and some of this I will. This is fun too for patterns, and uh, when it's printed like this, it's just kind of fun for your patterns. Oh, how nice. Talk about useful. Oh, isn't this cute? This is a little bag for a doll, and inside are the clear rubber bands. I use a ton of these. I use these not only for um, hair ties, but also to tighten joints and some of the fashion dolls. I just did a um, Tiffany Taylor, and I used a bunch. Thank you very much. Look at these. Oh my, my, are those cute. Oh, you know what? It makes me think of Mitty White, my, the ones I just did the face up for. And who can't use um, alphabet beads? I use a lot of these. I put my Blythe names on their um, pull strings. I have a lot of Blythe, and I'm old. Sometimes I forget. And those are in color, though, like I the love ch that. children blocks. Yeah, oh, toddler. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Oh, how nice is this? Handmade by Sarah. Let's pull this out. She is so talented. She uh, she also, I, I can't remember if she still does. I think she and her family still do um, cosplay. And they make all kinds of stuff for their costumes. And oh, God, that is so cute. I wanted to be careful before I just shanked it out. Look at that. That is tea tiny. I love that. Thank you, Sarah. Let's see what else. Oh my, my. Let me pull this back off the beautiful card. I know a lot of people, and I could do this for like my um, 18 inch dolls and bigger, the Reborns, they put their names on a little bracelet which is really cute. Oh, what do we have here? Look at the bulb. Oh, it's a mushroom. I'm an idiot. How cute is that? Wow. 
That is so adorable and clever. That is three granny squares done in little bitty yarn. Oh, that is clever. My AGs, uh, American Girl dolls, are gonna look so cute with that, and all year. That is adorable. Oh, look at this. A headband. This is her own crafting. Oh, I saw these on Sarah's channel. How cute is that? I think it fits a midi blythe. We're gonna get one out. Let me grab one here. I've got one right here. Pull this out. Oh gosh, this is so stinking cute. Yes, that is for a midi blythe or maybe a smart doll too. About the same size. Look at that. Oh, oh my goodness, that is so cute. Oh, Sarah, thank you. What fun. Hug in a box, I'm telling you. It is a hug in a box when someone sends you happy mail. Oh my goodness. Stand up, sweetheart. And we have one more gift. This is really fun, Sarah. Thank you so much. Oh. Oh. I saw these and these on Jay Doll's channel when Sarah had sent her a Happy Mail. I don't have, um, I collect the um, postcards with the Blyce on them, and now it looks like I collect them in all sizes. Isn't that gorgeous? That is Sarah's own doll, and those are items she made. And look at these. Again, I'm sure she made those outfits. She took these photos. I am thrilled to have those. I might frame this and put it in my new dollhouse. Oh, look at this ornament. Isn't that, is it sparkling in the mm -hmm. camera? Oh, thank you. Oh, look what I got. Sarah, thank you. Look at this beautiful fabric. And I have a doll named Birdie who's, it's hard to match fabric with her. She's gonna get an outfit out of this. That is so cute. I, I can't thank you enough, Sarah. This is really fun. Uh, if you don't, if you're not a subscriber to Sarah's channel, go by and take a look. You will not be sorry. Like I said, Sarah does all kinds of things and she has a, she's, she has a sweet voice and that cute UK accent. <laughs> I just, I like, a lot of times if she's doing a longer um, tutorial, crochet tutorial, I may not be making that, but I have her on while I'm sewing. I can't really leave comments when I'm doing that, but I have it on and I, I it's just a soothing voice. Thank you for watching the Dolls Rescue channel. Please leave a like, a comment, and subscribe.